know that over 1300 years ago, Prophet Muhammad was actually encouraging people to quarantine. Dr. Craig Considine is a scholar, professor, global speaker, media contributor, and public intellectual based at the Department of Sociology at Rice University. He is the author of many books and articles. Dr. Considine's opinions have been featured in The New York Times, Washington Post, CNN, BBC, CBS News, Fox News, MSNBC, Newsweek, and Al Jazeera. He has been invited to speak at some of the leading international organizations and universities in the world. A leading scholar on Prophet Muhammad, Christian-Muslim relations, Islamophobia, Islam in the United States of America, and religious pluralism. Dr. Considine is the author of many books, articles, and op-eds. An award-winning professor at Rice University in Houston, Texas. That over 1300 years ago, Prophet Muhammad was actually encouraging people to quarantine. While Muhammad was by no means a traditional expert on the matter of deadly diseases, he nonetheless provided sound advice in dealing with something like COVID-19. Muhammad said, and this is a direct quote, if you hear of an outbreak of a plague in a land, do not enter it. But if the plague outbreaks out in a place while you are in it, do not leave that place. One day, Prophet Muhammad noticed a Bedouin man leaving his camel without tying it. He asked the Bedouin man, why don't you tie down your camel? And the Bedouin answered, I put my trust in God. The prophet then said, quote, tie your camel first, then put your trust in God. He also said, those with contagious diseases should be kept away from those who are healthy. Cleanliness is part of faith. Wash your hands after you wake up. You do not know where your hands have moved while you sleep. The blessings of food lie in washing hands before and after eating. So what was he encouraging here? He was encouraging people to, you know, seek guidance in God or in religion in general. But he also hoped that people would take basic precautionary measures for the stability, safety, and well-being of all. Thank you.